Hi everyone. I did stop over here because I had that question I had to ask them. Because I got a call while I was in Monroe to uh, let me know that I still need to have a machine while I sleep. <laughs> and uh, I, she said to call or stop in, so I just stopped in since I was on this side of town anyway. And uh, she said, yeah, we got the order. Do you need anything from us now? And I said, no, I said, uh, and she said something about I would have to call for my supplies once the order gets filled. So it's like, okay, well, see, I won't know anything until the one manager comes in at the supply place because she's off until Monday. So I won't know. But I had the oil change on this. They said the car is actually a good car. That's exactly what they told me. First they told me it was junk it was because it was burning oil. But they checked everything over and said actually this is a good little car. And it's like, well, I kind of figured it was because I checked it over myself. It just so happened that the PCB valve and the timing issue went bad when I was driving it from Toledo to back home that day. And now the car is running fine and I don't have problems with it. Because they gave me a little inspection thing that they did. That's why it took longer. But yeah, they said the car is a good little car. They said this should last you a few years. It's like, well, that was the plan. Because my plan was to keep the Fusion as long as I could. And I had it for three years. And, the, and then the insurance got high on it. The plates are high on it, and it needs that part for the heating and air conditioning, and it also needs the passenger side suspension addressed. And it's like, well, I don't want to put. It's going to need about three to four hundred dollars worth of repairs, and I didn't want to put any more money into that car. And it's like, well, I'll just get something newer. And I figured, well, I'll give it to my aunt because that's a good car to drive around. I know with the type of job that I have, driving it as much as I do, the suspension would break. But since she doesn't drive very far, according to what I was told from Monroe, they said since she doesn't drive very far, the suspension will hold out for a long time on the passenger side. And I just, I know with me putting over 400 miles a day on a car, it's going to go out quicker. I want to try to get that car over to her as soon as I can. Because I want to get that car off my insurance. I did get the satellite radio switched over, so... to stop it right here. Please like, please subscribe. I'll talk to you guys soon.